Right, since I loved you, man, in the end there. The following is game one of Grand Final! Oh, I love it. I'm <laughs> shook, dude. That like is a Stu classic. Stu, Stu asserting dominance uh, over everybody. Yeah, so here we go, folks. Shoyo James coming from the winner's side. Energy Nairo coming from the loser's side. Like I said, there's a lot riding for both of these guys right now. James trying to conquer one of the few skeletons he has left in the closet. Demon or Nairo Demon trying Demon. to win the big dance here. It's a help. It's not, no, it's okay, a uh, not good. Okay. Yep. <laughs> it's good now. That was a great recovery. Like, dude, the thing though, like Koopa Man, I took. Uh oh. Yep. That's it. Yep. Schwank. <laughs> On his way down, he's like, all right, see you. He waved. He waved goodbye. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. But the thing is, like, James has been playing so well today. The thing, and I bring this up a lot in commentary, is like if you make your way through the losers bracket, you've got to be playing damn well to, to make it back to grands. You know what I mean? Yeah, On the loser side, like it's not it's not a coincidence. So and, and that's Nairo heating up. It's just maybe the scariest person uh, in the game to play when they're when they're heating up like that. I would love to see like a stat sheet of like the percentage of people that make it to grand final from the spot that Nairo lost that. Yeah, 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 right for sure. That was just out of top 32, wasn't it? Like that was round like, one of top 32. Yeah, so it was like 25th basically. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Still got to jump. You're even gonna uh, swing too. I like, I like the idea from Nairo. Like he tried to, he tried to roll in, get a counter, or knock him out of the up. But it was too late. James, James knew what he was doing. Doink, double doink, double doink. <laughs> Do I hear a trip doink? <laughs> Do we eat the tray? Yeah, yeah, the, the turkey doink. The, yeah, the turkey doink. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was a turkey. Four <laughs> tail. <laughs> <laughs> okay, James, let's go. Great conversion right there from the crown. Like I said, dude, he's playing so well today. This is, this is some of the best Smash I've seen James play uh, in Ultimate, which is really saying a lot. So yeah, I, dude, I think without he's just a, a doubt. Dependence player. Ooh, great air dodge right there. That's one of the calling cards for James, that he's a phenomenal uh, user of Krom's directional air dodge. Ooh, Except okay. right there, he died. But, you know, such is the breaks, man. That's And that's, like, really the scariest thing about this matchup for James. Like, not only, like, Pau is really good off stage against, like, pretty much anybody, but against Krom especially, like, that Nair, Fair. Like, you don't have to hit him too far off the stage. And Nairo, we've seen him edge guard everybody in this top eight. You know what I mean? Go off stage against every single person. So James definitely got to be very scared of that, or at least respected a ton. So, like, yeah, without a doubt, man. Fine line between fear and respect. Yeah, but James has brought himself back, you know, in the driver's seat for the most part. Both these guys kind of trading blows uh, in neutral right now. I feel like that's just sort of the calling card of this matchup, though. Is like, if there's ground beneath them, Krom is calling the shots. Once they're off the stage, hunt for the jump, and then that's it. Nairo's taking the lead. Oh, looking for the up air, but James finds one instead. Here we go. Ooh, close to flame. Just a little late on the punish right there. Look at how much Nairo respected James right there. Like he had an air, he only got like one or two hits, and that's not I was it. Just yet. saying why, yeah, <laughs> but it is kind of why. That beggar is still scary. Trump back air. Let's get uh, another one. There you go. Okay, James taking game one right there. I feel like Nairo was looking really poised to take that game one for a while. Like I feel like he had a lot of control, but James got the clutch hits, got the first, got the the last sock in the first game. It's nice, man. But keep in mind, I'm pretty sure, like I said, it's like the last like four sets in a row. Nairo has dropped the first game. And That's he's true. gone back to window sets. That's true. So, you know, he shows that whatever that, that first game is, it's kind of it's batting practice. It's it's down it's getting the information he needs. So we'll see if it makes a difference here. Because James again is a horse of a different color. This is the only person that can, you know, no disrespect to wishes or anybody else, but like James has been kind of the second torch for New Jersey for a very long time. Yeah, he's yeah. been able to Remember, Sma Remember Smash Con? Smash Four? That was yeah. awesome. James and I had to fight then too. Remember that? Awesome. Yeah. It was crazy. That was like two years ago. That was a Smash Con that uh, an hour long. Was it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That was the crazy loser. He's down 2-0 against Wadi. That was, that was sick, man. But anyway, enough, enough about that because we got to watch Nairo fight against James again. James off to a fantastic start here. And keep in mind, he's the one sitting on winner's side of this. He's just two games away from taking this from Nairo. You know what's the huge thing is how he's dealing with this pal of Nair. I feel like a lot of people just don't, A, flat out don't know how to deal with the Nair, or B, just can't. But he's been doing the turnaround up and that's 26%. Like, you, you, you got you to pick your spots here. See how Nairo's just fading away with the Nair now? It's so smart. Well, it's not smart. He's, he'd be an idiot <laughs> if he just kept doing the other thing. So he, he's making the appropriate adjustments, I should say. I, that was sick, though. Yeah, that was a great catch on the apex of the soaring slash. Uh, oh. Yikes. There's, there's a lot of spaghetti coming up for both guys. But again, the jab, Rar Bear. James practiced that in my car once, fun fact. <laughs> he literally laughed jab, Rar Bear in the backseat of my car. So. Only 23 at that time. One or two of the hits must not have connected. I'm telling you, man, that up B out of shield is a saving grace for Krom in this matchup. But the up air toward the top. Good scoop up there by Nairo. He's going to tie it up in terms of stocks. 
I feel like killing off the top is really important for Nairo in this because notice how James is constantly escaping these. He's not running to the ledge as is conventional for most characters. Constantly up and towards center stage. He needs that room to land. Yeah, but now Nairo going, writing a novel about how to edge trap people, uh, you know, with using James as the pen. But yeah, yeah. James I able to find a respite again. Okay. okay. Both players kind of fighting for center stage here. Nairo, nice. Good use of the auto radical. Jump in a, a meaty air dodge, dude. Smart. Perfect recovery option right there. You see, James uh -oh. is fishing for the, you know, he knows his win condition right now. Perfect. Very surprised that Nairo did not go out there to try to challenge that air dodge. It looked like there might have been enough space for him to do so. Especially with the move as active as an air. I feel like, you know, going for the air dodge towards the ledge. It's just a good option. Oh! James just stood there. I feel like he was ready for that air dodge, but he didn't do anything about it. Uh-oh. Okay, smart, smart. Nice. Mixing up his angles on his uh, air dodges, too, so. I, I thought he might have to pull an up there, but that was smart. Uh, oh, that was cute. Yeah, yeah that's cuter. So this is, this is how it's done. <laughs> oh. She goes, oh, you countered? Okay, counter. You know what her counter's called? The counter. There you go. <laughs> you almost got me for a second. There we go. Keep the well, counter until it's reflected. Oh, all right, you got it. <laughs> I should have said that as a <laughs> to mix you up. True. Back air, let's do the tech chase situation. Naira's so good at Wow, forward air into back air? It's not the easiest input in the world to do, I gotta say. Yeah, you see Naira starting to get a little bit more comfortable with what James is throwing at him right now. Jesus. Just chucking him off the stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good cutoff right there. Didn't let James float close enough to the ledge where he could air dodge. Naira taking that one down pretty convincingly, I gotta say. Especially that last stock. That last stock was super clean by Naira. Yeah, I must say. That is a stage that needs to be kept far and far oh, away that. from James. <laughs> or rather from Nairo, because that was like what? Yeah, that was really good. So we're going to see that the obvious really banner Unova from uh, Nairo. I wonder why. Because of the, tel the teleport? Yeah. yeah. Is that one of the secrets, Taz? No. Oh. <laughs> I'm never telling you guys. Neither of you. You're yeah. taking it to the grave. Yes. <laughs> Put it in my tombstone, then you can look. <laughs> it's so morbid. That's what it is, man. You guys forced me in this situation. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Deal with the hand I'm dealt. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Keith the Human, man. That's my guy. Keith? Yeah, he's just, <laughs> he's just hey, like. Don't he's bring like, up Keith right now, dude. I was on such a streak of not talking about that song. <laughs> anyway, we had James Man pressure underneath the platform. So good. That was, I feel like James couldn't decide which side of uh, his body Nairo was going to end up on. So he, he, he's kind of late on the upbeat, now he's really paying for it. Yeah, man, without a doubt. I should have just said he got crossed up. I don't know why I went the, I took the scenic route to say that, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's when you're trying to finish the paper and you gotta be that character limit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah right. it's like, there's a semicolon, another semicolon, parry, you gotta run up after that. Thereafter instead of there. Forward. Right, there we go. Using full expressions of and, not Forward using. aerial, backwards aerial, <laughs> narrow with the doink. <laughs> yeah, you didn't see that one coming, that was a mix up. Oh, I think he meant to do a turnaround. Oh! Talk about mix that was, I'm mixed. Jesus. I am thoroughly mixed right Jesus now. That was absolutely dude. insane. Gosh darn it. Well, dang nabbit. <laughs> <laughs> I love Sorry. Crumb. It's, Sorry. Okay. it's okay, Crom. Yeah, we forgive you. <laughs> I feel like they grabbed Matt Mercer and they only let him do one take for every line. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way that I could justify anything that comes out of Crom's mouth. <laughs> I'm telling you, that up yeah, shit was nasty in this matchup. <laughs> Is there, there are pretty much characters that just straight up really can't deal with Nair and Shield. Yeah, pretty much. Like, you know what I mean? It's just, it's that low slash right before the rising hitbox. Good. So good. He gets Ooh. armor on that stuff too, yeah? I um, believe. As a B? On the uh, rising part. Yeah, on the yeah, rising, on rising part, right. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> James did a great job avoiding that up air too. Uh, wow, and they jump synchronized too. That oh, was dope. There you go. There's there's the next clip that's gonna get used in a trailer. Yeah, that right. Sick, yeah. <laughs> we'll see that in a YouTube trailer compilation clip, yeah. this weekend. <laughs> Swinging that wow. center stage, such great patience from Nairo. Wow, it's gonna get met out with a dash attack. Yeah, so James Nairo blinks first, but Nairo able to reset the situation once again with the back throw. Flame. Sorry. Tie it up. Yeah. <laughs> not Bobby. apologize that time. He was angry about that one. He's like, I'm not sorry, actually. Man. That's stupid. <laughs> it's a really good option, man. <laughs> it's very dad-like of Krav. It's being very polite. 
I like that mix up. Nairo, a couple times, has been running up and shielding. We saw him stay in shield a lot, so that time he just ran up and grabbed instead. Just mixing it up, dude. So important. The basics, man. Fundamentals. I would be very scared to engage with James on these platforms, but Nairo, again, showing no fear. Nairo, Nairo at all. fears no man. No he human. can't afford to fear. <laughs> God! That we flashbacks can. that first stop, dude. <laughs> Yeah. Jesus! <laughs> don't don't don't! Yeah, <laughs> I just broke out in a cold sweat. That time, that time it wasn't uh, it wasn't fear. That was respect. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, that's not good. great so, coverage right there from the Nairo. Yeah. So you take Crom's jump. He's so weak, dude. That's all, that's like a saving grace. His jump is, is pretty solid, along with the, the air mobility he has. You take that jump away, it's over. It's over. <laughs> Curtains <laughs> for the Crom. There's a crown pun in there somewhere. Ch I just James doesn't play any other characters, does he? Like, yeah, no, this no, is... Yeah, yeah. Uh, he played Ice Climbers steel. in a Friendly with me once. Full steam and ahead crown for Brian. Yeah, and he played uh, Ness I'm once. I'm talking about against, against players he respects. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Sorry, you got me with that one thing. I had Ladies to and gentlemen, this will be my final broadcast. <laughs> <laughs> No, obviously it's gonna be the crown. So go back to town and yeah. city. To answer your question, he did play uh, Nessa Dent, uh, to meme back at uh, Glitch. But what? Yeah, James is just a character. He doesn't. He hasn't found his Luigi to his Diddy Kong yet. You know yeah, what I mean? Right. So. Yeah, he, he is really. He's a great co-man guy. You know what I'm saying? I love watching him play in Smash Bros. Still enjoying him in Smash Ultimate too. Yeah, man. You know the cool thing about that down air? What? She actually doesn't hit them with the stab. <laughs> oh really? Yeah, you don't say. Yeah, it's, it's a <laughs> I'm never inviting you to my house ever again. <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> Hold on. Dash attack, too? Love it. Because, you know, Krom, like, my jump away trying to fare there. That dash attack is just too good. Great little string right there from James. He just I think the, those little hits. Yeah, I was going to say, I think the comfortable part for James in this matchup is going to be that he's, it's not going to take much for him to get back into it. Because Krom just hits like a machine. You know, you know who had a great little string? It was, uh, it was Leon. Yeah, he had one long one. <laughs> Wow, what a scoop from James. That was so nice, dude. Calling out the, the teleport cancel, warp cancel. It's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> the oh vanish God. cancel. Oh, oh look at that. Wow. 64%? Beast mode. Beast mode, baby. I love it. That was absolutely nuts. James didn't even flinch to the camera, by the way. We get him next to Krom. They kind of look alike, don't they? Krom, yeah. Krom and James, like a little, a little bit. You know, I think it's the, the facial expression that really really drives it home. <laughs> They're both, both also like serious. Mad it's nice. Serious, yeah. I need James to start saying sorry at like 1.25 <laughs> speed. Oh, oh okay. man! Okay, there you go. Yeah, that was like a hanging curveball from Nairo, and James just, just swing. Oh my oh, god, oh continuing god, to work dude. right here. This is ridiculous. James is Fellas. so good, dude. Yeah, I'm saying, dude. Are we on our way to a game five? Maybe. Let's uh, see if Palutena's up there has anything to say about it. Yeah, but James still has a stock to sit on. That's true. But Nairo's also come back from crazier deficits today, so I mean, that's true. Oh god, he ran forward and just shielded. Okay, Nairo, up B again. Why not? Yeah, the up B out of shield has just proven to be such Tell a me. great uh, get out of jail option for nice James. Movement, dude, too. That was really, really good. Nice couple wavelengths there. Just walking away, man. James doesn't want to put himself in any bad situation. The last thing he wants to do is get chucked off stage and gimp very easily. Oh, gasps in the air as that back air whiffs. <laughs> it's like we're the in-game crowd. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they said yeah, it, dude. A couple other games. We're like the 64 of the main Wow, level. okay, let's go, James. You see him? Yeah, man. Truly a platform <laughs> fighter. Like, oh, ooh. <laughs> this is a platform. That back air scoop. Who does that? Wow. That's absolutely insane, man. That's a, that's a retaliation. That's a solid, solid two stock, dude. James's game plan with his second stock was perfect. It was he played it flawlessly, dude. He played with the lead exactly oh, perfectly. Man. That was nice. So here's where legends are made, folks. Not on Pokemon Stadium, too. No. <laughs> this no. is where this this is where things are this is where magic could happen. Is James, like I said, gonna expel that final skeleton from his closet? Or is Nairo going to punch his ticket to another uh, dance with Shoyo James? Let us see uh, what comes out on, who comes out on top here in this game five on Pokemon Stadium too, ladies and gentlemen. So there's no, no DSR though. No DSR, not in these Yeah, parts. we don't run DSR in these woods. Well, that's working out for Nairo. <laughs> like yeah, honestly. 50% to start this one off. <laughs> yep. Nairo just, just kind of running away with this one, dude. Depending on the platform, too, this is a bad yeah. situation. Shield's low, that Nair's going to poke. Yeah, good starts are huge for Nairo. Yeah. I think that's, like, very important. I think the closer to combated the sets are, the more it might favor James, just because, like I said, Krom doesn't need much of a 
he doesn't need much wiggle room for a comeback. Whereas I feel like Narrow obviously wouldn't rather play from ahead in most of these situations. He's an air dodge there, man. Oh, God. Yeah, that was a bad situation for Narrow. Able to make it back, though. Pal's recovery is very good. He's scooping it up. Up air is such a good option, man. The hitbox is so big. It's so powerful, especially because you're usually rising and carrying them up towards the top last lane. So it's really Ooh. nice. Ooh, OK. Nice. Good bait by Narrow. Yep. Okay. Bypass. Yeah. I think he was trying to land on the top platform and try to slide off, but either way, he's still living. He'll take it. Oh, Ooh, God. caught him in the middle of the combo. No, oh, my Prom God. Prom is definitely not feeling good after that. That was no. a very beefy hit coming out. That was like a, a tough 41, you know? Oh, nice. Good roll away, too. Smart. Yeah, that's a mix-up that James kind of... Like I said, James doesn't always show his cards at first. He kind of waits until the right situation for it to, ex to execute. Yeah, Yo, James has definitely earned an hour's respect in terms of being on the ledge because he's just been teleporting behind him a lot. He's like, man, I know how good you are. You know, forward tilting at the ledge is so good for Prom. So if I teleport behind you, it doesn't work. Oh, no. What a great recovery from James. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Back throw. <laughs> oh, this is getting out of hand kind of fast, to be honest with you. Yep. Die. Stay alive. But he's like good. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh, oh, my. It was looking like the worst situation in the world for James, and he just turned it around and made it. Oh! Perfect. Oh, what a guy. I respect was, it. I, I respect it. I respect the hell out of it, yo. Right, he's got another set to work with. If Nairo came in with an aggressive recovery, it was going to catch him on the way on, on the bottom. And if he missed time that teleport, it was going to kill him, too. Or the yeah, one. exactly. It was, it was good coverage, man. Nairo, Nairo though, like, he, he's pretty good at avoiding cheese, I'd say. Yeah, I'd say so. Yeah. It's, it's really hard to pull the wool over Nairo's eyes sometimes. Exactly. Plus, like, James has showcased that he can play on the deficit, if Ooh. need be. So, like... Ooh. Heavy percentage, but if he manages to take the stock from Nairo, he's still not out of it. That's true. Grab, hold up. Ooh, he's looking for a scaredy cat option. James, not a scaredy cat. Ooh. Can't right. confirm not a scaredy cat. Yeah. Counter into it. Oh no! Okay, perfect spacing on the counter. Wow. Yeah. Man, or on, on the up that was perfect. Let's see if he teleports behind him. James is ready for it. You saw him run yep. back for it a little bit. Yep. He was, he was looking for that one. Oh, dude, I was. That was so, that explosive claim was so scary. Ooh, right right in the center, James is shield too. Shield poke, boys, brings us to a grand finals reset. Yeah, dude, uh, that was, oh, hold on. I think Stu's about to go off. I have a feeling. <laughs> he's, he's lurking somewhere with the microphone. He's, he's going to drop a bomb. So Where is he? I'm going to keep quiet. Is, he's not going to say reset? I feel like wow. that's such a Stu line. Anyway. Right, I guess that's I the mix-up. I think we're safe. We're safe. The no stew like, mix-up. Like you look, you like look twice before you cross the road. You know, that's me right now. I'm just looking around for <laughs> stew. Like, where is he lurking? And then a bike comes out of nowhere instead of a car. Yeah, yeah. A razor scooter. Anyway, <laughs> right to the ankles. All right, man. Smashville gonna be the game one of this bracket reset. Nairo against James. Uh, gotta censor that one a little bit. All right, we're good. We're back. We're back. All right, let's see how things work out here, man. Terrible situation for James. Good job pulling the trigger on that air dodge right to the ledge, though. <laughs> you know, I'm really curious to know what James is banning on that he lets Pokemon Stadium 2 happen, because those seem like extremely difficult matches. Yeah, I agree. I was thinking the same for Nairo and, and uh, Town and City. I feel like, I feel like the, the bans might change this game, you know what I'm saying? Definitely yeah. end up on Stadium game one. Ooh, jeez. Yeah, that's scary. Nairo kind of committed early, though, so James felt confident that he was going to work. Ooh, the drag down upper once again. Uh, saving Nairo's bacon right there. Nice. Did what? <laughs> what is that? Jab, jab. Oh my God! Looking for the back air. If that connected would have been curtains. I'm pretty sure. He's so close oh yeah, to without a doubt, yeah, right? Nice, good jab too. Trying to fight Nairo while he's in the air. Down tilt. Good air dodge. And he up these two. Good job by James, man. I can't can't compliment this dude's recovery. No. He hit something in the air, but it wasn't Nairo. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> is it a villager? Oh, God. So one, one of the Animal Crossing characters. Um, can we get some security at KK Slider's concert, please? Maybe that's why Tom knows not in Smash. Well, he's not in Smash because he's no <laughs> Can't say it. Anyway. Now go. I want to know what you were going to say. <laughs> you guys don't get that. Ooh, yeah. nice back air from James. Hey, I haven't said that all night. Very proud of myself for that. It's tough when you got Palu versus Crom. Yeah, too. it's like, tough oh, when yeah. the back airs are actually yeah, nice. Real. You know they're, right, they're out here, man. Again, I'm surprised like it's not a Nair. Oh, that sucks, man. He really needed to finesse that recovery. Kind of like we saw it earlier where it's possible to, to kind of trigger the counter but not get hit by it. So I think it's just trying to do. You have to go super low for it. You gotta get low, get low. Yo, uh, I love gotta that. jump. Oh, oh man. Still lost the stock. Yeesh. I was like, all right, he's gonna jump down, he's gonna counter nice and easy. Nope, he went, he went for the, he went for the dunk ski. 
Nairo going up big time. Game one, all the momentum I gotta say is, is on Nairo's side, man. Like big, like for sure. Yeah. If you're James, like James has been chilling in Grands for a little while, and he just watched Nairo go on the war path. And it's like, damn it, like the one dude. You know what yep. I mean? Like, like if it's anyone. That's what I mean, man. That's the storyline yeah. that yeah. I've been trying to weave this whole time. But you know. <laughs> well, you're Again, welcome. like like for as long as I've known James, I very rarely see him get tilted. He's one yeah. of the best players I know for sure at, at being He's, able to keep himself composed under stressful situations. Yeah, yeah. But you know, this is a big deal. Like I said, this is a big deal for both parties. And let's uh -huh. see who's you know wh which uh, wall is gonna crack first. And yeah, now we're trying to take one home, James as well. Vanquishing a bracket demon along the way. Let's see if he can do it. And he's off to a good start in this game too. And he got he got town again, Hangman. I don't know, dude. Like, I, I honestly I feel like this is a really good stage for Palo too. But James is just he, he feels so comfortable here, and the way he moves around is so good too. Like James is operating so well on the stage because he has so much room to move. And even though yeah, Nairo has got plenty of room to move with Palo Town. We've even seen a couple of teleport yeah. cancels so far within the first minute of game two. It's yeah. like. James is going to run away with the percentage that he has. He's going to net his stocks really well. And then game three, probably taking us to Pokemon Stadium too. It, just, it boggles the mind because both these players are playing so well on their stage picks. You would think that one of them would want to disrupt the momentum somehow. Yeah. I mean, when, when you have a comfort, you know what I mean? It's kind of hard to break the habit. Yeah. It's like it, getting chicken fingers at a diner. Like, you know it's going to be good regardless. <laughs> We're like, where are you go? Are you calling Tenant City James's chicken tenders? Absolutely. That's amazing. The platforms are barbecue sauce. Hold on. That's an F-tilt? Yeah. Scoops at the ledge. Sure. That's cool. Fair enough. That's how it is. It's, it's it's sometimes that's the way it is. Nice good use of the nair there. Catching the spot dodge. <laughs> Yeah, you see all the, and you see James just has nothing but center stage. Like even if Nairo leg like, is not in in danger of getting, Ooh, ah! <laughs> he got yoinked. See oh, ya. God. All right, man. Now we're tying that one up. Not taking any damage until that up be connected. Twenty six, man. I'm telling you. That's a six. That's a sick twenty six point four. Yeah, right. Nice. Four, oh God. Do it again. <laughs> no, he's on the platform. <laughs> uh, Where are we okay. going? I don't know, man. Like. <laughs> Back here? Uh, I think he might be dead here. No, he's still got a jump. Uh, no, he used oh, he's using yeah, jump. Yeah, that jump. Yeah, that guy sniped him out of it. And what's crazy is that James hasn't hadn't been getting like heavily edge guarded by anybody the like entirety of the winners bracket I've seen him play. That's honestly like I feel like that's where James feels best is like like town, town city platforms are definitely his home. He, he's happy recovering on them. He's happy fighting on them. Just getting KO super early. <laughs> Was that funny? I thought it was funny. Oh, thanks, I boss. think you're funny. That wasn't funny though. I gotta go. I wasn't doing anything. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? Now I'm self-conscious, dude. Thanks a lot. Wow, that was a great nair actually. Because <laughs> he's he's calling out. I feel like Nairo's gotta be a little more careful with those warp cancels because James is definitely onto onto his yeah. tricks. Like we talk about not being able to pull over the wool oh, over Nairo's eyes, but James isn't like you know he wasn't born yesterday either. So nair. Oh. oh my God! <laughs> that was that was cute, man. I wish I kind of wish it worked. Yeah. You know? That was that was a heat check uh, <laughs> mix up right there. <laughs> great, great pair. He definitely lost his stock if he missed time that one. You know, I would hate to be in either of these guys' shoes right now. Like, yeah, they're deep in this bracket, but like, the pressure is so hard on both of them. Yeah, man. Like, look at, look uh, where I'd, I'd like to be Nairo right now. <laughs> like, yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? All right, right now, yeah, that's a pretty good look. Oh but, my God! Uh, James is so good at that, dude. Like he, he hides. He does such a good job, like kind of concealing himself in that sweet spot between like where the blast zone indicator is, but also before you can see him back on the stage, and he just jumps and fares. So it's smart. But Nairo going up big time, 2-0. See, if they, I want to see what James can do here, man. I definitely at least want to see him take a game, uh, start making the, start making it a little more competitive in the set too. But Nairo, man, all the momentum in his sails, pushing him forward, He's trying to take down the C tier tournament, man. He was so close, like we said before, so close at collision, even closer now. Always up. the bridesmaid, never the bride. Every tournament that he's attended in Ultimate, this could finally be the break that he needs. Yeah, man, here we go. Let's see, but let's see what James has left in the tank, man. Like sure. I said, he, he, I very rarely see him get tilted, so. Yeah, yeah. And he's been able to play hit for hit with Nairo. That's so, very, very hard to do. So, so. In, initially, the up B against Nair was working out so well for James. I feel like it's whiffed so much. Nairo's figured out how to deal with it. So now, like, now, now the meta is developed, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> to, to compound that thought, I feel like we're seeing a lot more smash attacks from Nairo that are involving the wings from Palatina. Those wind boxes are offsetting James' positioning, forcing him to use some sort of a resource, whether it's a jump, a directional air dodge. It's leaving James more and more susceptible to stray hits. Uh, ooh, that could have been a really nasty situation for James, but able to find respite. And again, making great use out of that up, he had a shield. Uh, 
He's barely missing that platform. He's going to be missing it here, too. Oh, That's okay. a recovery. It still helped him out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The okay. platform was almost not James's friend right there. Start the landing. Wow, that was so quick, dude. Oh, wow, my God. Amazing. No scope. Out deep. Like I said, dude, James is usually so good at hiding in that area. And now he's like, no, no, no. I see you. I see you over there. <laughs> All right, James, what's, what's your counter? It's like the worst game of peekaboo ever for James. Yeah. Yeah. There we go, the classic. The, the first hit in air two to forward smash. Like uh, daughter, Captain, like father. Captain Falcon stuff. Yeah. <laughs> We're fine. You went with Lucina? All right, that makes sense too. Yeah, man. Sure, fair enough. Daddy, daddy daughter, uh, bread and butters. <laughs> that, that was bars? <laughs> what the question mark? It's like the weirdest store. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know where to go with that one. <laughs> but James really, really digging deep. Oh, oh my god! The sh movement what from Shoyo James. What a guy, what a god. Jesus. That's Nairo too. He's like we said, it's so hard to trick him like that. And holy god, did he get tricked? I feel like there's hardly any player in all of Tri-State that has a sense of micro movement the way that James does. Like, who's yeah. gonna know the wave dash like that? He's, and he's make got something out of it. Nice. Again, the perfect the perfect distance right there on that up He's able to avoid the counter, but not able to avoid that back air. Nairo putting James on tournament stock here. Is it going to be a 3-0? Is James going to make this one a little more competitive in his favor? There you go. That's the up we're looking for. Uh, sure, there's another one we're looking for. Hey, look, it's pretty look good. He did it again. Oh, my God. Uh, going for the home run read right there, but he's Nairo. For, he's like, hopefully Nairo rolls three times. Yeah. In this. <laughs> I would have done it. <laughs> I would have just died out of respect at that point. You know what I mean? A B? Okay. James doing an amazing job. Can I get a counter for how much damage he's got out of that collectively? That is absolutely oh insane. Yo, we need someone to start tracking this meta. <gasps> oh! oh! <laughs> Nairo went back to the ledge, too. That was so smart. Oh! Yeah, no really sense good. of fear in this man. Uh, James is pulling out all the stops right now, but Nairo, once again, finding uh, the breathing room he needed. God, Nairo playing so patiently right there, waiting this one out. Back air, James in trouble. Nairo going for it. No, cannot find it. James can't find the killing blow. Oh! oh no! no! I, uh, <laughs> that so was almost so poetic. Yeah. He's still crumb and he still has a crappy recovery. That's still so, a bad situation. So as horrifying as that looks, it is worth noting that at a certain point of units, the platforms are not tangible anymore, so you actually don't get tricked. You fall out. off, yeah. yeah. But still, he's crumb. Like, it still sucks. Oh, right, uh, is that going to be it? it? Ladies Nairo and gentlemen, it, it is. Nairo 3 0 over Show You James and after a bracket winner. reset. Oh, there he is. And <laughs> Super City <laughs> Grand Champion <laughs> and RG <laughs> Nairo. One last time. Clap it up for your boy, baby. Thanks, <laughs> thanks Stu. As you see the, the look of exhaustion on Nairo's face. Uh, He's still salty about that set, dude. He's still <laughs> mad he lost. You won the tournament, Nairo. You played amazing. You got a lot of great wins along the way. You held your composure together. That's what you love to see from the kid, man. He's such a champion. So glad to see him finally, you know, take down a tournament here in Ultimate. He's come so close so many times. This, this time he's able to do, uh, string them all together, get the big W, and move on. Yeah, man. That was absolutely fantastic. Yeah, yeah, so like you're said, awesome, yeah. I would love... <laughs> No, he was. I, I <laughs> no, shout out to Stu, man. He did a great asset job. And let's, I would love to see the percentage of people who come from potential 25th to making it all the way to grand finals to winning the tournament. With all the people that he had in his path, too. Yeah, this Let is us not forget that not just this top eight, but this whole top 32 had just a demon's row of players waiting and willing to take out Nairo. I got to say something. Do you? New England will be back. <laughs>